Okay, this video is going to be on the Adobe Illustrator Pathfinder palette. If you don't see this palette, you can always go under Window Pathfinder. Here it is. Now, you've got two kind of rows of options here, the shape modes and the find in the pathfinders. You're going to find that some of these actually seem a little bit redundant, but we're going to go through each of them. So what I've got in here, as you can see, I've got a series of rectangles and I've got circles. And what we're going to do is we're going to select both of these objects. I'm going to select the rectangle, hold down my shift key, and I'm going to select the circle. Now this first option here is going to unite. So it's going to unite both those objects together. The next option here, I'm going to select both of these options. Again, I'm holding down my shift key and I'm selecting through them. This one is going to minus what's in front. And notice the it's the uh, gold circle that's in front. So it minuses that one out. The next one down the list here, selecting them both. The next option is going to intersect. It's going to give me where they intersect. And so that's all I have left. The next option down here, or set, I'm going to use this one. The last one on the first row, exclude. So it's going to give me everything except where they intersect. Okay. We'll go down to the next row here. I'm going to select this set here. This one I actually find really helpful. It divides all the objects into multiple pieces. So I'm going to get one, two, three pieces. So I'm going to divide. The issue with this tool is once you do that, it actually treats it as one object. And to get rid of that option, you have to ungroup them. So I'm going to go object, ungroup. Now I can go through and I can pull all the pieces apart. The next circle and rectangle. The next option is to trim. I have to ungroup them. Object ungroup and it trims the object but still gives you this circle. The next group. The next group is going to merge. Merges them together. However you still retain the the lines, very similar to the Unite option. Next group is going to crop, okay, very similar to what's happening here. Again, some of these options are a little bit redundant. This option will actually just give you an outline. Do that again. I'll quickly create another rectangle. Oops, 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 rectangle. I'll use this circle right here, bring it over here, select both of these options, or objects, and outline. I'm not sure how helpful that is, but it, it does give you that option. And the last one, minus the back, so whatever's in back. So I'll hit the undo, bring those back as they were, select them both, and minus the back. Okay, that is the Pathfinder. I really like the Pathfinder a lot. I find just the first one in the top row and the first one in the second row are really the ones are kind of my go-to options with the Pathfinder.